Let's add the fractions one third plus three eighths. And here's how we do this. We need to find a denominator. We need to get the same denominator for both fractions. Because once we have the same denominator, when we're adding fractions, we just add the numerators and keep the denominator the same. So probably the best way to do this, find something that three and eight both go into. And I could just multiply three times eight, and then over here, eight times the three. Because when I do that, I'll get 24 for both of these. That would be a common denominator. But I can't just multiply the denominator. I also need to multiply the numerator here by eight. Because eight over eight, that's just one. So I'm just multiplying by one. I don't change the value, just the way it's written. Over here, since I multiplied the denominator by three, let's multiply the numerator. So eight times one, that's eight. Eight times three is 24. Over here, three times three is nine. And then eight times three, that's 24. So now we have the same denominator. Let's just add the numerators, eight plus nine, that's 17. And then when we're adding fractions, if these are the same, we just move that over here and keep it as 24. And in answer to our question, one third plus three eighths is 17 24ths. This is Dr. B. Thanks for watching.